Okay, so. Sorry, classmates. It's all right. Now, the main important thing that I want you guys to understand when we're writing a factorial is a factorial for any number, if let's say I have n factorial, what that means is 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 times 5 times n minus 1 times n. So you, what you do is you keep on multiplying from 1 all the way up to until you get to n. Okay? So let's look at an example. 4 factorial equals 1 times 2 times 3 times 4. Does that make a little bit more sense rather than with the variables? Yeah. So now, to evaluate this, what I can simply do is just write the factorial for each number. Don't overcomplicate it. Just write the factorial for each number. This would be 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 times 5 over 1 times 2 times 3. Well, obviously, ladies and gentlemen, you guys can see those divide to 1. We're only left with 4 times 5, which equals bank day. Boom. That's all you're expected to do. Now, 